Hey guys, what's up? I am exhausted, but I kind of want to film a video, so I'm going to film it now, and I'm freezing, so don't mind me. Um, yeah, this will be separate from my next vlog, so enjoy. So I'll be starting out with my W7 Spaced Out Galactic Glimmer Palette. It's an eyeshadow palette, and the color is Orbit and Interstellar, and I'll be spreading those on my eyes. So yeah, I'm the determined look. But first, before we spread makeup, we gotta take off our glasses. That's right, that's better. Now we're gonna go in with Orbit and Interstellar. They're like a, it's a light, kind of creamy brown, brown taupe. I don't know. It's a nude. Yeah, nude. This is about the moment where you think it's a good idea to use a blending brush to do eyeliner with black. Then you very quickly realize that you look like you got punched in the face. One second. <sighs> Makeup wipes for the rescue. Ay ay ay, ay. Mad Dog Bichon. So this is the moment when you realize you're supposed to actually use another brush. You, I went in the cause with black hole and used it as an eyeliner because I didn't have access to my other eyeliner at the time and it's actually a really good idea too. So yeah, I went with it. So this is what the first eye looked like. I'm giving you a thumbs up because I went in and did the second eye in black hole. And this is the totalized look. This is the eye look so far. What do you guys think of it? Let me know in the comments, okay? I'll be your best friend. Ooh, work girl. So next it is eye mascara. One second. I can't do mascara on camera, so I didn't show you it. And now we come to contour, my favorite part. Oops, I dropped it. Hey guys, still using uh, the Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette. I used the first one, which I've actually hit pan on, and I'm very sad about it, because I love that palette more than anything. And then I use, I dub off the ends, because there's too much usually, and then spread it, like, triangle shape in my face, and then on both sides I do that, tap off the excess onto the other side, and then I usually blend it in with my fingers. I don't know if that's how you're supposed to do it, but that's the way I do it. So, don't like it? Too bad. I know I'm not James Charles. I know I'm not, like, friggin' Nikki Tutorials or anything, and I know I'll never be. But I'm not claiming to be it either, so just so you know. Anyway. Blend, blend, blend with my fingers. Blend, blend, blend with my fingers. I'm really tired if you can't tell. Ay, ay, ay. That's what travel will do to you. Yep. Mm hmm Oh my god, how long does this clip friggin' end? That's the completed contour look, and now on to my favorite part. Highlights. So I got the new Naked um, Illuminating Highlighter in Sin, which I absolutely love. I bought it actually when I was away on vacation. Got it at TJ Maxx for like two bucks, so I didn't honestly expect it to work, but it actually is really quite nice. I, I love the applicator on it, and I didn't realize how to actually like blend it, because I thought it would just like blend in with the brush or whatever, but apparently not. So I just searched for my beauty blender at <laughs> one point, and yeah, that's the highlight, that's the tea, and yeah. So at this point, I'm searching for it, and now we blend. And oh, by the way, I'm not looking at the camera because there's a mirror above me, just so you all know. Because that's why, like, if I'm not looking at the camera, I'm looking at the mirror to apply my makeup properly. So I don't look like a clown. Because Cl Krusty the Clown is not a good look. Just saying. Any hooser. And we blend all that crap in. And we glow. In three, two, one. 
So next, I'll be taking my Naked Illuminating Highlighter Prime Highlight Palette in Aura, which I absolutely love. It's also by Urban Decay, and it's one of my favorite products. It's one of my most loved, to be completely honest with you. I highlight the sniffle out of my skin every time I wear it, and I can't get enough. So yeah, I'm sorry if you can hear my chair rattling in the background, I apologize, um, not really, because I don't really care. <laughs> I'm tapping off the excess, actually blowing it off, and I blew it in my face, and like up my nose and stuff, and I know it's TMI, but meh, whatever. As you can see, I'm looking up into the mirror, not into the camera, because, yeah. Anyway, so... If you can't tell, this is like a really dewy, glowy look, and I quite like it. You'll usually see that a lot in my tutorials. Like, I know I'm not very good at it, but I try, so whatever. Anyway, yeah. And then next, we're going in the Maybelline Master Contour Blush. And we're just going to put that under the cheeks, under the highlight. There's several inches of highlight and contour. And yeah! Okay, so next we're gonna do brows. I'm using my Naked Basics palette, and I'm gonna, yeah, I have a hard time with that opening my nails, I'm sorry. Anyway, I'm gonna go in with the color uh, Ne Fate, I think it is. Anyway, I'm just filling my brows, cause they look rough and they need to get done, and I haven't gotten them done since before I went away, and I had my surgery in two weeks, so I kinda need to get them done before then too, cause they look disgusting. And yeah, so yeah, there's that, I guess. Um, I'm using that little brush from that new palette that I bought because um, that's just easier to use when I'm actually filling in my brows instead of doing my eyes, if that makes any sense whatsoever. There we go. That's what it looks like so far. So option A, B, or C. Let me know. Actually, wait, no. By this time, they get, by the time this gets posted, y'all won't be able to answer, so I'll let you know. Clearly, we went with option three. Um, that color is Violet something from Avon. I don't know if you can actually get it anymore, to be completely honest. I quite like it, and it gives the look, like, a bit of a different look. It's, like, bold. It's kind of soft eyes and like bold lips. I love it. I usually do that like spring, like fall. This will be my look for the fall pretty much. Mostly. Hey sort guys, of. this is the final look. Kind of a glowy neutral with a pop of color. So, yeah. Mm hmm the finished product. I hope you guys enjoyed and let me know what you think. Bye!